this is called. That wooden post? Deep. Huh? Doesn't seem that deep, but hmm. what? Oh, those, yeah. There was an old looking lantern there. American Picker. Pickers are probably like that. There's like an old looking lantern. Where? Oh. even bad. It's not even that bad. It's pretty usable. Score! Nick, that might that might cause that stuff to move. This is supposed to be Burr. It's probably a part of that the little planks that they had. 
That one? What is this? Uh, looks like a turn in the middle of those posts that goes right here. Are these theirs though? Because huh? they have a whole. These guys must be. I think it's theirs. Who's? These people. Oh, okay. There you are. Oh, yeah. Look at all the plates with flowers and stuff. Like little offerings. In that a is so of a mile. different. Turn right on yeah, the it trail. just keeps going. And Jemima bottles. See the Aunt Jemima bottles? They're everywhere. They must eat a lot of syrup. some plates and stuff. Blue bottles. Where do you get blue bottles from? Um, plates and balls. Pans. In 1,000 feet, turn right. Yeah, they look just clean. They got a couple of trailers. They got a container on their property. Lots of glass stuff. Maybe he's a glass blower or something. But plates, just dozens and dozens. And dozens. Ceramics and glass, that's, maybe that's his thing all the way out of here. Yeah. Plenty of sand to work with. It's so been abandoned and people have been thrashing it, it looks like, yeah? Yeah. Right, the window, one, see, one window's still in though. And that shed doesn't look too bad in the back, the garage. Huh. It looks pretty much intact with the door on, doors on and everything, no holes. And then this place doesn't look bad. You got the tank, propane tank outside. Here's the road, snail trail that it wants me to Waves is telling me to turn on. That's a caution cable, so there's all these telephone poles out here with electricity on it. They said it ran through my property, so I'm trying to figure out where that might happen. Probably over there, on that side of the... Yeah. Left on Kickapoo Trail up here. Kickapoo, we saw that earlier. Looks like somebody's living out here. Mm -hmm. 
structures. Got a little wash right there. He's got a lot of fencing around this guy's his property. Which is probably the way to go. I'm pretty intrigued about these uh, these towers or these decks, these elevated decks that Two of them? Starting the deck. Look, there's more lumber material. Yeah, and then he's starting to shed out. Oh, and all that. A couple of sheds. I guess they like the decks. A more RVs, but a lot it's of a RVs, lot. a lot of fencing. Must be a new prepper. Style cooking. The home cafe. How European. places. Man, the wind, I can just imagine, the wind just wreaks havoc on it. Just, as soon as there's an opening, it just starts slowly tearing at it and just day by day, just blowing it, blowing it, ripping it apart. Yeah, you know, it's not windy out here all the time, but I guess when it gets windy, it's, it's pretty, pretty windy. Shitty. Yeah, so.
wolverines. Desert Ranch, that's what it says. Holy oh. <laughs> oh, Where'd she go? I don't see her. It's just the car. No, there's a Is she in the back? Oh, okay. there's a lady sitting in the passenger seat. Oh. I can't see her. Continue straight for 15 minutes to 20. 